were here at the annual VES Honors event and you were made a new VES Fellow. So what does it feel like to get that kind of recognition from your peers? Well, I'm pretty humbled by the company that I've suddenly been put in. Um, these are guys who I've known of or known personally, respected and uh, admired for decades now. And uh, I have no idea how I ended up in this group, but um, it's pretty amazing. And you were also our one of our early uh, honorees with the New York Sections right. Empire Award. Right, right. So what's so special about working in this field in New York? Um, I would say it's the nature of the directors and the projects in New York. They tend to be smaller and more personal and quirkier and there's been a long tradition of directors working in New York and this goes back to the film days because they could keep away from the studios. It was, it was a way to, um, like in the editing process and stuff, be able to do their work without the, the suits breathing down their neck. And I think that attitude still prevails even though the technology has changed. There's sort of a, a, a renegade attitude towards people who choose to work in New York and not, and not go mainstream. Got it. Do you have any go-to advice for people who are aspiring to work in sort of this kind of creative field? Well, it's interesting. Um, this most recent film I've been on, well, let me back up a little bit. VFX has, in general, always been considered like the, the bastard stepchild of the camera department, um, kind of the fix-it guys. Um, but for just odd reasons, I got adopted by the art department on my current project. And it was pretty revelatory. It wasn't intentional, it was just kind of an accident of circumstance. But it brought a whole new way of looking at what I do because when you come at it from the art department attitude, you're imagining and creating things in your head and you bring them to the camera. Um, and I think that it's the wave of the future. I think VFX is going to be much more art department and much less camera department oriented. So to all those film schools teaching people nuke and stuff, I'm kind of going, maybe think a little different. <laughs>